Hey YouTube, what's going on? My name is Equagan. You call me EK. I stream daily at twitch.tv slash Equagan. In today's video, we're going to go over the Heritage Shotgun. The Heritage can drop in the second and third encounter of the Deepstone Crypt Raid. You need five red borders in order to craft it. And it is one of those shotguns that is pretty fun to use. Most people, I feel like, know which role that they already want on the Heritage. First and foremost, this is what I had when I didn't craft it, right? I was just missing a few things, right? I was missing like the assault mag. I think I had accurized during the time. And instead of fluted, I think I had corkscrew. Overall, this is, you know, I'm gonna get directly to the point. Fluted, my uh, my masterwork is handling. My, you don't need enhanced recon and you don't need enhanced recon. I have it on there because I have the materials needed to, to put it on there. You can have just, just regular on there. Now, I actually went out of the way to level up another one because I saw a very interesting perk and I wanted to kind of work with it, all right? It's, it, it was one of those perks that I was like, okay, this can work really good on a punchy build. Most people know you get a heritage, you want recon, recon. Second heritage, I was gonna go for handling. I was gonna get my fluted. I was gonna get my salt mag. But I was going to put on Pugilist and Swashbuckler. You're like, Pugilist and Swashbuckler? Why? Well, here's the thing. Lately, I've been running around with my Titan and my Hammers, right? And lately, I've been running around getting Combination Blow and doing stuff. Now, on my Warlock, I don't use my Melee that much. But on my Hunter and my Titan, I use, I use it a lot. And on a Slug, I feel like I can get a lot of good damage out, especially if I get that 35% extra damage here. Let me... We don't need this to be uh, enhanced. I don't. I don't even like. I don't even think I'm gonna make it enhanced myself. So on Gunsmith, you could probably see this a lot better. It's one, two, three, and four. So my RPM goes up because I'm using assault mag. The neat thing about Pugilist is final blows with this weapon gives me melee energy, and if I deal melee damage, right, it improves my handling. Handling is one of the things that I love having on a slug shotgun. Now, the cool thing here, too, is this. Primary and power weapon kills give me 10% of my melee energy, right? Specials grant me 20. So this is a special ammo weapon. So if I get if I get five kills, my melee is going to come back, all right? And if I deal melee damage, I get 35 handling for three seconds. My handling is currently at 85. That allows me to be like, uh, do I really need this fluted barrel here? Can I go with something like Hammer Forge for range, possibly? Maybe I just want stability, range, and handling. Overall, you know, like, what do I want the most of? And I feel like small bore might be a good play here for a second one. The reason why I say that is because if you're using this to what I think you're using it for, because if I put handling here, look at that, that goes up to 80, right? If I proc pugilist, you know what that gives me? That gives me 35. So I don't really need this at 80, right? I can get this to about 65, maybe. So for me, reload would be one of my better friends here. So my reload would be up more, all right? So for this role that I'm going for, reload is going to be my masterwork. Reload, pugilist, swashbuckler, with assault mag and small bore. That is going to be my second heritage. And if you if you end up crafting something like this and you, you use it a bit and you kind of like it, let me know. I'll be here, you know, at twitch.tv slash equagan. And I say 35%, by the way, I believe Swashbuckler at five times is like 33.3% or something like that. I just, I I rounded it. But once again, you get 33.3 extra. So imagine having the Heritage, you run up to something, you hammer it, boom, Swashbuckler's up at max. And, you know, you have a big target in front of you. Recom is freaking awesome because you basically get double the damage if you stack it up enough. But it's only in one shot. Right. Whereas with Swash, I can kind of do that for a bit. Um, you can even do Swash and, and Recon if you want to, if you feel like Pugilist is not helping. I just feel like Pugilist is, is a pretty fun perk and it goes well with Swashbuckler. I, I also wanted to make this video as short as possible. So that is it for this one. If you have any questions, you know where to find me. If you like this video, please make sure you hit the like and subscribe. Also, while, while you're subscribing, when you turn on notifications, make sure you go you turn it off from personalized to all so you can get all the videos that come up from this channel. And I'll see you on the next one. Deuces.